Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm here to do your mid-March to the end of March reading. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus Signs, North Node, or if you're cross-watching for Leo. Before I get into the reading, can you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Can you follow me on Instagram at I am underscore Justina Nicole? Everything will be down in the description box below this reading. So Leo, what I have for you... I have the Eight of Wands, the Ten of Wands, and the Five of Pentacles. And I have the Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Leo, you could be having issues with a, a Earth sign, a Capricorn towards Virgo. Or you could be having issues with a fellow Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Leo, or this could be someone in regards to you. I feel like someone wants to communicate or vent about their issues they've been having with a a person place or a thing but I'm, I'm leaning more towards a person in a relationship or it could be friendship another message i'm getting um leo this could be you or someone in regards to you it's like since you've been gone somebody's life haven't been the same a uh, multiple people, Leo. Whoever you distance yourself from, or if this person distanced themselves from you and multiple people, I feel like y'all lives have not been the same without this person. If this is like a friendship or a relationship. Another message I'm getting, somebody had like a strong impact on you. Or you feel like you had a strong impact on somebody, but now you're seeing like you actually didn't. <laughs> Leo, yeah, Um, if you're not reaching out, these people could be reaching out to you. Yeah, Capricorn towards Virgo or Aquarius Libra Gemini. Or Aries Leo Sagittarius. I feel like somebody wants to vent to you. Or Leo, this is another message I'm getting. Someone could want to vent to you about their relationship with someone else. Somebody don't know what to do. Or they feel like maybe you have some advice. Or maybe you have some type of... I was getting ready to say insights or some truth or clarity for this person. Another message, somebody don't understand why somebody is treating them differently or why somebody ghosted them, left them hanging. It could have something to do with this earth sign and air sign. Or Leo, this is you. But yeah, like the other messages I'm getting, somebody wants to vent to you about their relationship problems or relationship issues with somebody else. Or Leo, you want to vent about your issues that you're having with someone to somebody. It, it's something like that going on. I don't have the moon card out here, but if someone uh, hits you up, Leo, or if you hit this person up and they start expressing to you about their issues they having with their spouse, I feel like the reason why, or a girlfriend or boyfriend, one of the reasons why they having issues, because somebody like grew up, somebody matured. I heard to a higher consciousness or something. Somebody's not the same anymore while somebody else is still the same. That's why somebody got left out or Leo, this is you. You want to know why you and somebody else don't communicate anymore? It's because somebody like evolved and you're still the same or Leo, you evolved and this person is still the same.
Yeah, and whoever stopped giving to this situation, I have a lot of earth out here. You could be dealing with a Capricorn towards Virgo. Or you could be wanting to talk to a Capricorn towards Virgo. But who, look, I'm just giving the messages. Whoever separated themselves from you, Leo, they actually doing good. And they actually happy that they don't talk to you anymore. Or Leo, this is you. Somebody feel like, you know, by them not associating with you, they made a good decision. And Leo, if this is not you, this is the person that's going to reach out to you to vent about their relationship with someone else. Um, just know that whoever initiated this separation, this person is happy that they don't, um, deal with this person anymore. Somebody been stopped giving to this relationship or this friendship. Somebody been removed themselves from this person. But I have the Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Somebody is still in love with another person that don't fool with them anymore. Period. Point blank. And like I said, Leo, uh, I don't know if this is you or someone in regards to you or this person that's going to reach out. Whoever's going to reach out, this is another message. They the ones that still have love for the other person that's separated from them. But somebody just not fooling with this person no more. Or they not fooling with you, Leo. Or Leo, you not fooling around with this person anymore. Somebody grew up or somebody don't have time for the bullshit, the pettiness. Somebody's just not the same anymore and they're happy that they don't deal with y'all anymore or you don't deal with them. It's some type of success somebody feel because they don't fool with y'all no more. You don't fool with them or they don't fool with this person that's going to reach out. And somebody is a burden too. That's another message. That's why somebody don't uh give to this situation I heard even entertain this person because somebody is actually a burden. I heard toxic. Somebody is actually toxic. I don't have the devil card out here, but look, the moon. <laughs> the high priestess in the moon. The hermit could be a Virgo. Yes, yeah, somebody wants forgiveness. Oh, Lord. But yeah, that's all I have for this reading.